11 non-stop minutes of news and weather. Western Mass News, 11 at 11. As the state's migrant crisis continues, a growing number of local communities have been designated as supplemental shelters. In Hadley, several migrant families are now staying at a hotel turned emergency shelter. Welcome everyone to Western Mass News 11 and 11 on this Tuesday. I'm Chris Pisano. Western Mass News reporter Maria Wilson joining us live in studio tonight with the story. Maria. Chris, more than 30 people are now staying at the Night Inn in Hadley, which is a state-designated shelter. Just a couple of weeks ago, their arrival coming about a week before the governor's November 1st deadline to stop adding emergency shelter units. Hadley joined a list of more than 90 Massachusetts communities providing emergency shelter to thousands of families. With only two weeks' notice, town officials had to kick preparations into high gear. The timing of it um, and the, the lack of um, preparation, we really had no warning at all. Two weeks ago, the state designated a Hadley Hotel as a supplemental shelter for homeless families, and by the end of last week, town officials were notified that four families had moved into the Knights Inn Hotel, which sparked an immediate response from town administrator Carolyn Brennan, the local police department, and other state officials. We got together a task force within the within the town with certain departments to say, let's let's be prepared, let's be ready, because you really don't get any kind of notice. And in the days since the families arrived,